Item number, SCP-341. Object class, safe. Special containment procedures. The Exhibition Hall of Reliquary Research and Containment Site 76 has SCP-341 on display for all research and command personnel to view. Description A collection of eleven brass and iron orreries found in a large storage room of a basement at Oxford comprise SCP-341. Each orrery is a rough-scale model of a different extrasolar star system, complete with planets, moons, and one or more suns in the center. A unique clockwork mechanism under each orrery allows the brass models of planets and moons to spin on axis and rotate around each model of its parent stars. Testing dates each machine to be between 150 to 200 years old, but without any specific markings, researchers have been unable to determine who created them. The orrery collection of SCP-341 was set to be released into the hands of a local museum until an SCP astronomer with a piqued interest in the discovery recognized one of the Ories, SCP-341-E, as star system Upsilon Andromedae A, unique for being a solar twin of our own sun, with hot Jupiter-like planets. Further research has matched five of the eleven Ories with possible known extrasolar systems, including Beta Canum Venaticorum, 37 Geminorum, HD 98618, 18 Scorpii, one orrery, known as the Wheel of Doom amongst researchers, depicts a similar solar system very reminiscent of our own souls. Though the planets and sun themselves are neither near to scale nor space proportionately, the presence of seven major planets of our own system is fairly obvious, including Saturn and its rings, and the tilted side of Uranus. There are also five minor planets included beyond the orbit of Neptune. The orrery is missing a model of Earth, and instead has a free moon roaming through a debris field, similar to the asteroid belt present between Mars and Jupiter. Lesson complete. If you missed the previous orientation, go watch SCP-340, Viral Rebreather Membrane, right now. Or for the complete course, Watch this playlist.